Warning, this video may cause you to leave a like or even subscribe. Please, don't stop yourself. Android for life, yeah! What's up, people? This is Viva Android Fluffy Bunny, and today I have episode two of how to edit awesome pictures on your Android. And this episode, I'm gonna show you how to do this, colored, and then a strip of black and white, and like font on it. And then you can see strips of white outlining the black and white and colored sections. So first you're gonna need Pixay Pro and Fonto. I'll have both of them down in the description. You're gonna need to go into Pixay first, get a picture and take it out over here. First you're gonna have to go to pop colors and you're gonna wanna just click check. Keep it black and white and then go to export. Save picture to album and then just save it. And then you wanna go to menu, history, undo to previous picture so like just go back one step and then after that it's gonna be back to colors after it's back to colors go to effect insert picture and then insert that picture you just saved which is in pixay pro the folder okay so when you take it out it's gonna look like this and then from here you're gonna want to choose a part that you want to make black and white so the part that I chose was my eyes and a little bit of my hair like that so that's the only part that's gonna become black and white so you're gonna click check and then it's going to be smaller than it is, so just grab this and then stretch it to the edge of the picture, to the end of it. Make sure it's straight. It's kind of straight right now, but... And then go here and get it with the picture. It's going to take you a couple tries, but you'll get it. Okay, like that. And then just reposition it. And that looks good. It doesn't have to be perfect because you're going to add white strips. And I gotta notice it really. So just press check, check, and then no. And then go to stickers. And then go to the one that says basic shapes. Take the square over here and just make it white. Once you make it white, click that. And then it should come up with this icon, which makes you drag it like this. You know, just make it really long. And then just drag it down, make it skinny okay so you're gonna add it to the bottom of this and then you want to make it really skinny and then just grab it and add it to the bottom of it and then you want to get another one and just do the same thing for the top same exact thing except for the top strip and then you're gonna want to do it like just get it the same size and you can do it as thick as you want so I'm actually gonna do this kind of skinny and change the other one you zoom in and then just reposition it this one's kind of too fat, so like that, and then like that, you can see that it's coming together. And then you can go to effects and then just change around the effects, and then the black and white is getting changed with it, which looks kind of cool, so like, I'll go to saturation, and you change it, the black and white gets like kind of more black and stuff, so just press check, go to adjust, smooth, I always add smooth to all my pictures because it just makes it look cool and really smooth and good. See, and then I go to export, Fanto, it just puts it straight into Fanto. And then from here I added a text that said Fluffy Bunny four times. So there. And then press done. It's right here. It's kind of big so just put it on the edge and then go to size and just reposition it. So that's good. You don't really want it from edge to edge. You can like continue like that. You can change the font and stuff. I'm not changing it because I'm just showing you guys how to do it. And I'm just going to put my name. So I put my name. And I put it over here, but I just put it, I put it bigger than the other one by like a lot. So kind of like that big. And there you go, but you know, just change around the text, like the font, to how you guys like. Like menu, save, and you're done. From here, I want you guys to go to Instagram, and then export it and stuff, and then just put a hashtag in the title of your picture that says Viva La Android, and I'll check it out, comment maybe, and I'll like it for sure. So, hope you guys enjoyed this one. I have a lot more editing photo tutorials coming out soon, and make sure to subscribe for more. Please leave a like if this helped you out. It's really appreciated. It helps me out, and it helps you guys out too with more videos. So, thank you guys for watching. Peace!